Hi, I'm Nick Roche, and this is my 6131 MIT Power Electronics final project. So for the project, I did something that was based off what we showed, what was shown in class, which is a uh, using PID control and two potentiometers to make a motor follow a set point. So using one potentiometer and another potentiometer to read the position of the motor, I can make the, the motor, which is indicated motor position, which is indicated by this bar, follow a set point that I set. So the way I've done this is I've used uh, these three circuits over here. So over here we have our simple DC motor, and if you look on the back you can see the pot that gives us the position of the motor itself. And then over here I've got this uh, PCB here, which, which is an, functioning as an H-bridge. This is just kind of a breadboard, not really doing anything. And then this is the potentiometer that provides me with the position setting, and a Arduino, which is using a digital control for the H-bridge and uh, also providing me with PID control for what it is I'm trying to do. So uh, if you look at my computer over here, get rid of the Gmail, you can see the sort of Arduino prompt and then uh, another prompt here. So what actually happens is if I move the potentiometer, you'll see the motor move. So rotating the potentiometer with my hand, you can see the motor moving like that. And we're using PID control. I'm not using the, the D term in PID control, but still the, the I and P terms. So uh, it can actually maintain this position, and if I apply pressure to disturb it from that, and then let go, it'll actually go back to that position. So you can see it's just going to oscillate away and return back to that same steady state that it was at before. And it can actually go all the way up to this position here. You can see it's actually stable there, balances itself at pretty much any position you want. Um, yeah, so uh, that's basically how my project works. That humming you can hear is actually because the Arduino can only drive this motor at 500 hertz, so that's what you're hearing. But uh, yeah, thanks so much for listening.